Clover fresh milk is way better. Made with love by Clover. Clover's change. Clover's cheese range offers good quality and value for money and is also so versatile to use in many ways. So today it is the hero ingredient in our epic oozy cheese corn no need bread. And if baking seems like a crisis to you, there's no need to worry. It's easier than you think. Get it? <laughs> Fumla, besides my corny jokes, <laughs> what do you have for us today? <laughs> so I'm going to take you through making this recipe. It's that simple. Okay. So you've got cake flour here, sliced spring onions, smoked paprika mm. for a bit of kick, mm. some egg whisked, okay. butter melted, and you've got that cheese, that clover cheese. We've got cheddar, but the mature one yes. from clover, and we have the tassels. So that's a nice one. It's also very gooey. So if you want to okay. dip anything in it, that's the one. Okay, got then you. Then you've got the milk. So we make, we put everything in the bowl. Okay. So we just kind Maybe of Maybe you hoi. can help me. We can just yes. hoi. Yes. Okay. Just hoi everything in one bowl. Mix it together. Yeah. Tip it into a baking pan. Okay. Lined with parchment or baking paper. Okay, perfect. So, so okay, far we've, we've put more in, cheese. Uh, we've got mm. all the cheese in the world. So you mix all the ingredients. Okay, so I just want to um, update our viewers. So, yes. so far we've put in the paprika for the spice, the kick. Yes. We need to still add our clover milk, but so far inside we've got our cheeses in there, we've got our egg in there. I love, we've all also put the corn in to mm -hmm. kind of bring it all together. Okay, now to bind it. Okay. We need that milk. So, like a cup, I think. Yes. So this recipe, like this recipe actually has all the goodness of clover because mm. all the cheeses are made from 100% milk. Oh, I love yeah. that. So they are a very great source of uh, protein, protein, calcium, as you know, mm. and a great source of energy. So here's your pan, Pali. Fantastic. It's already smelling so good. I am a sucker for corn. And it looks corn. great too. It does. So my favorite way um, of serving it, mm. I normally like it, just a slice of cheesy bread. Oh, nice. And then a salad as a nice starter. Delicious. And a very light one as well. And at the top of the show, you did mention that this makes a great side for For fries. a braai. Yes, we love braai. Oh, yes. So another thing you can do, once it becomes stale, it's actually great because you can toast it. <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing a good job here, but we'll just pretend. You just level it out. <laughs> okay, cool. So you bake that at 180 degrees. Nice. On a preheated oven. Oh, delicious. 25 to 30 minutes, depending on the strength of your oven. Okay. Are there any ways that we can do different variations of this recipe? Oh, yes, precisely. Mm. Um, so what I like to do sometimes, you, because you are not limited to only the two cheeses I've given you here. Oh, okay. So you can maybe make a three cheese bread. So where you do the tassas, you do the macho cheddar, yes. and you do maybe a clover feta. Deli so um, soft cheeses would also work with this. It doesn't have to be these gooey ones that just Anything melt. goes, Pali. The cheesier, the better. The cheesiest, the better. Oh, yes. That sounds exactly like what I want. Okay, so one thing that I absolutely hate is cleaning up in the mm -hmm. kitchen, right? And this seems like something so fun that you can do with the kids and get everyone involved. Oh yeah, precisely, precisely. Uh -huh. um, so what I think, I think this recipe gives you liberation to do whatever you want to do. You create your own. Yeah. Mix the cheeses up, make yeah. a three cheese, make a four cheese, top it with more cheese, just like we do in a pizza, for yes, example. Yes, 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 so yes. So what Clover wants us to do is to have fun with cheese. I can't believe, and what Clover has also done, has made it super easy to buy cheese. If you're like me, I'm slowly mm -hmm. learning the palettes, I'm slowly learning Together. cheeses, but what Clover has done within the packaging, they've mm -hmm. given labels and color coded every packet. Mm -hmm. So whether it's a mature cheddar, whether yes. it's a Tassas yes. cheese, then it will say whether it's a medium taste, whether it's a stronger taste, and the, yes. taste and the softness. For example, that's what we did here. Mm. The Tassas is much milder yes. and softer, and then the mature ch cheddar, it's much more strong and it's a harder cheese. What's your favorite, I have to ask? Mm, a little bit of everything. No, that is the easy way out. <laughs> you know those mothers who say every child is my favorite child? No, you have to choose. No, you know why I like doing that? Because mm. I never want people to figure out how I made it. Uh -oh. So now if I just put one flavor, two flavors, it's easy to know. I get you. Yeah, so my thing is, I want to make it a secret. <laughs> okay, know? well, with all those secrets up your sleeve, if you, you need, if, I'm so excited to eat, I can't even talk. If kneading is not your thing, then mm. this one is for you. SMS the keyword Clover to 33650 to get this recipe sent straight to your device. And if you have 
a little neediness in you and you want to see this one more time, here's a quick recap. <laughs> Made with love by Clover